Praise the Lord. Hello everyone. I bring greetings to you all in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. I welcome each and every one of you to this online Bible class. So before we start, let us commit this time to the Lord. Heavenly Father, I come before you today. Lord, thank you for this opportunity that you've given us. Father, I pray for your Holy Spirit to help us, to guide us, for understanding your word. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So, the topic for today is about John the Baptist. John was sent by God to prepare the way for Jesus' ministry. John's mother, Elizabeth, and Mary were relatives. So, that means John and Jesus were cousins. And John was born six months before Jesus. So, this story can be found from the Bible, from the Gospel of Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. So, now I would like to show you one short video about this story. Jesus, God's Son, was growing every day. He was getting older and wiser. While he was getting ready, there was another man of God preaching and teaching. His name was John the Baptist. He knew Jesus was God's son. He knew Jesus came to save the world. He wanted to make sure everyone heard this good news. John began telling people to get ready to meet Jesus. John the Baptist stayed in the desert. He wore clothes made from camel's hair and had a leather belt tied around his waist. He ate locusts and wild honey. Have you ever eaten honey? How about locusts? People came from everywhere to hear John preach. They were sorry for their sins. They knew they needed help. John baptized them. John knew and loved God. Some people even thought he was God's son, but he told them he was not. John told people he was coming to help people be ready for Jesus. John did God's work because he loved God. He told everyone, I can only baptize you with water, but when Jesus comes, Jesus will put the Spirit of God in you. The Spirit of God will help you to know if you are being selfish and when you are pleasing God with your whole heart. Then you will know God's love and others will know God's love is in you. That is good news. So, children, what do we learn from this story about John the Baptist? As children of God, we should always ask Jesus for forgiveness. If we do anything which is wrong, if we disobey our parents, or if we lie to others, or if we steal anything, we should always ask Jesus to forgive us, and He is always ready to forgive us. So, before we close, let us bow our head together and pray. Heavenly Father, I come before you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus, for this time that you've given us. And thank you for your love, for your goodness, for your faithfulness over our life, Lord. And thank you for your protection, Lord Jesus. Thank you for your Holy Spirit that help us and guide us to understand from your word. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.